He's normally at the back, the one who does. Ah, oh, you know, he gives us a peek, doesn't he? Yeah. Uh, I think they waved. Did they? Yeah. Probably. It's a whole thousand sub thing, isn't it? It is. Since, it. since we got to a thousand subs, yeah. it's just got mental. Well, outside your house, just chanting yeah. ultralight lads. I didn't carry my pants, but through my letterbox yesterday. <laughs> I love you boys from <laughs> Ken. <laughs> That's weird. I like it, mate. It's nice and warm. Watercolour's good. Yeah, it looks really nice. I think the three gram jig head's just a bit too heavy, though. Really? Yeah. What are you on? Ah, uh, 1.7 gram. Yeah. Oh, felt like a hat. Looks like we've had a bit of rain up here. You can see all out there on the fields. It's become a, a lake. Mm. So we're going to be starting off with the Z-Man tubes today in, um, in the deal colour. I've been getting a lot of hits on these recently. Conditions look really good today. It's pretty warm. No wind. Nice bit of colour to the water. And quite a few fish would feed on the surface, so fingers crossed. They say no wind. First bit of wind I've felt. Any green today, mate? Not I've seen so far, mate, no. Some decent size ones, weren't they, last time? Look at those pikes out here. I've drawn him right in close. He's looking at me now. And he keeps having a look. Yeah, literally, that's on his nose. See him? There he is. Oh, he's looking. He's keen. He's all right, yeah. Yeah. Turned on it. Yup. Oh. <laughs> Too keen. <laughs> that was cool, wasn't it? Yup. Yep. Yes, get on. Well. <laughs> nice one, Wig. Brilliant. It's so good taking them like that, though. <laughs> I don't know how deeply hooked he is, but hopefully he's right there. Yeah, it's right there in the in the north. Wait! <laughs> <Get on>. Nice! <laughs> Mate. Cool. That was a bit of fun, wasn't it? <laughs> there we go, look. Minimal stress. We'll just um pop him in the net and he can just go back to where he came from actually. Just in here. So cool, aren't they? The first little fish of the day. Bit of fun. Little Jack. Freed me up a bit. I have to just shorten that leader, I think, marginally. Because what we don't want to take is any risks, do we? Any snap offs. What we'll do is just feel up there. And don't know if you can make that out. Just a couple of nicks there. Uh, that's obviously happened in that fight, so I don't know how, because I struck on it straight away, as you saw. So he never would have had that much line in his mouth. But it could have just caught on something externally, so we'll just chop that down to there. And then a lot of it's about confidence. You want to have confidence that your line isn't going to snap, and all those sorts of things. 
uh, if you do hook a good fish so we'll just we're only losing a few inches so it's no danger really you can see a perch what's well, another hat go on there's a perch just underneath these reeds below me not oh go on Any problem with these casting into the wind? It's a little bit of a challenge, that was an easy fix, though. But it would be if it hit my fingers. Oh, there you go. Wig. Oh. Oh. Just missed one. It's only a, only a pike. No, pike. Tiddler. It's a cucumber, Michael. It is, mate. Bloody good. Bloody good, mate. Yeah, there we go. Little cucumber. Got to be one in this little area here, isn't it? Loads of bits of weedy but clear patches. Seems to be their favourite areas at the moment. <laughs> Pike just come flying in, hit it at my feet, and it on for a couple of seconds, and it spat it. I just saw it come charging from there. Oh, that shit me up a bit. Yeah, it fried the life out of me then. I was just waiting to feel pain. Yeah, <laughs> I was more frightened. That shotgun going off right next to us, or my lure choice today, I honestly don't want to be frightened. <laughs>